What is the easiest way of adding border around the image in Pixelmator Pro? Select the image and then select the second tool on the list called Styles. From here you can click Add Style and the style we want to use right now is called Stroke. As you can guess, it will make stroke around the shape, text or any other object. So Stroke and now I got this thin black line around. Let's make it a bit thicker by adjusting this value here, how many points the line should have. We can change the color of it so it's a bit better visible here for us. We can pick any color from this spectrum here. OK, you can adjust opacity if you like. And we can adjust the style of the line here. From where we can also change how the line is attached to the image. It's at the center inside the image area or outside the image area. So if you want to kind of cover the whole artboard like that and you put outside, you cannot see the image because the image is outside the picture. In that case, you must switch that. You must click on the line and switch this to inside the image. All right, I will scale it back down a bit and modify more options here. So we can decide how the corner will be. It will be square or rounded. We can change it from here. We can decide about the end of the line. Or we can even change the line to be a dashed line. Just like that. All right. So that's how we can put a bit of stroke outline, a bit of border around your images. If this is not good enough for you, you need more control. Get rid of that and instead of using this default stroke, use a shape under the picture. So go to the shape menu and we can search for shapes. In our case, I will work with a basic rectangle and I draw a shape behind the picture. Just drag it behind the layer panel and now I can control it a bit better. We can size it exactly as we need. Take a look. I can make this bottom part of this border like larger so it gives us this Polaroid like feel. And of course, I can now attach different effects and style to that object, that rectangle that's below the image. So I can put, a, I don't know, drop shadow on it if I like. Okay, and the image is not affected by this because it's on the separate, separate thing. All right, so. Method number one, click on your image and add style called stroke. If that's not good enough, you need more options to customize it. Just draw a shape under the image that will work as our border. I hope this was helpful. See you in the next one.